A simple mistake right here or a dangerous precedent? Dashcam video captures a CHP cruiser smashing into a truck in El Dorado Hills. The video there shows the officer's lights were on, but now there are some questions about whether the officer used his sirens. CBS 13's Marissa Perlman is live at the intersection getting answers on who might be at fault here, Marissa. Well, Tony, the video you're about to see captures a CHP officer T-boning a truck right in this intersection behind me right here on Friday. And now there is an investigation open into whether the officer's sirens were on at the time and if that played a role in this crash. From the Friday morning crash is jarring. It happens in just seconds. The pickup truck is hit and flips almost 180 degrees. Debris flies everywhere. Coming down in this direction. Attorney John Campanella weighs in on the crash. He specializes in traffic related cases. In the moments leading up to the crash, you see the officer turn left from westbound Highway 50 to El Dorado Hills Boulevard. The video from a driver's dash cam includes some commentary on the screen and what he believes he saw. At the time, CHP says the patrol car was responding to a request for backup on a potentially high risk traffic stop. All right, there's the officer approaching there. And you can see now, watch his tires drop off of that, that divider thing. He kind of, boom, there goes the front tire. And he makes, you hear a little chirp of the siren there. At this point, the officer's emergency lights go on, but in this video, you can barely hear a siren. You probably wouldn't have heard such a little chirp. CHP says it's possible both drivers didn't see each other as they moved towards the intersection. Campanella says it's very unlikely the truck driver would have known the officer was crossing the intersection either. Procedurally, at least the officer pr could have made a little bit more noise with the siren because you really, you barely hear a chirp. But now we're asking who's at fault for this crash. CHP says the incident is still under investigation, but Campanella says likely the officer would be at fault. From what's presented in the video, it looks like the officer is probably negligent. Now, interestingly enough, Campanella does say CHP could be civilly liable to the driver for any injuries or damage to his car. We are happy to report tonight. Thankfully, no one was hurt in this incident. CHP does say they are continuing to investigate. See how it plays out. Head on a swivel when we're at the intersection, no matter what, right? Marissa, thanks. Live in El Dorado Hills tonight.